Hey, this is Zachariah with Cleveland.com. I'm here with Logan Broadbent, and he is, as his shirt says, a United States Boomerang Team member and champion. How does one become a boomerang master? For me, it's a little bit different than most. I grew up throwing and catching boomerangs. A lot of people will know of the boomerang man, my dad, Gary Broadbent. The boomerang is the first original flying toy, and it's estimated at 14,000 years old. Uh, he threw boomerangs for, for years and years, and so I grew up on the tournament field throwing catching boomerangs. Is there a whole boomerang subculture we don't know about? It's been an underground sport since, really since the early 80s. At the latest world championships, which was in Kiel, Germany in 2016, I finished second in the world. Uh, me and my five teammates actually finished first in the world. It's a lot like watching a baseball pitcher. Yeah, you know what? It's very similar. So boomerangs are thrown overhand, straight up and down. So very similar to a baseball throw. In competition, we're throwing and catching all day. So in an event called endurance, we can throw up to 80 times. We'll basically do what a major league pitcher does in an entire game over the course of five minutes. But you're not just known locally. You, uh, very exciting, you've been on American Ninja Warrior multiple times now. Right, so I do a lot of different competitions. I love running, I always do the Boston Marathon, and yes, I've competed on uh, American Ninja Warrior. Uh, this will be my third year competing. But everyone has to wonder if they watch you do something like a, a trick shot. How do you even figure that out? Like, is, is there math going on in your head? Do you see like a beautiful mind style graph appearing? The more you throw boomerangs, the more you get to know the boomerangs that you throw. So I'm so familiar with their flight patterns and their characteristics. All I really need to think about is exactly which direction I'm throwing, how hard I'm throwing, how much spin I'm putting into it, maybe how much, you know, slight layover I give it. And, uh, and usually I can be pretty accurate. Uh, some people from Cleveland probably see me practicing down at Edgewater Park over the summer when the weather's nice, and I love to teach people how to throw. So if you see me out there throwing, come swing by. Uh, I'll let you try throwing a couple of my boomerangs and how to throw and catch and be involved in the sport.